Hey what's up Musers, this is John at Muse for You, and in this video tutorial I'll be showing you how to use the SVG icon set as bullets in your Adobe Muse website. So you can gain access to the SVG icon set uh, at museforyoushop.com then simply go to shop and it's right here and you can preview it and here are all the icons. So I'll be showing you how to use these as bullets, you can actually yeah, use these as bullets in your website. So I have the sample site here, and if I hit Command Shift E to preview in the browser, we can see I have my list, and we have this icon as the bullet. Now, normally a bullet would just be like if I highlight this and I go down to the bullet up the bullet toolbar up here and click the down arrow. They're normally like so, like just a circle for the bullet. But if I highlight this and I go back to the bullet drop down, there's this option here that says plus new character. So I'll click on it. And then I'll select, um, here it lets me select the font, so I'll select the Muse for You Thin and Thick icon pack. And over here where it says bullets, I'll simply click there and click on entire font. Now I have access to all the glyphs from the uh, Muse for You Thin and Thick icon pack. The Since I've installed it as a web font, I have access to the glyphs and I can simply change the bullets to any of these icons. So I've selected this gear icon here and once I've selected it, I simply click add and then click OK and the uh, the bullets changed to that icon and I can make the font smaller and the bullets will change with it and it's just a really nice way to style your website instead of just having you know just regular fonts uh, you can use these icons uh, excuse me just regular bullets you can use these icons as bullets and I can you know even add more excuse me <laughs> uh, muse for you yeah, for you and another another bullet okay <laughs> another bullet and another bullet all right so it's a nice way to, to style your bullets and add more styling to your website and I can change the color as well of the font and the bullet will change as well which is very nice change it to blue as you can see it changes there so any changes you do to the font the the bullet will have those changes as well all right very nice and I'll change it back to the uh, to white here all right very good so that's pretty much it for this video tutorial I just wanted to showcase that that you could use uh, yeah just the different uses of of the icon pack that's available at muse and just you know kind of showing you the value of the the SVG icon pack there. So again, uh, you just go to museforyoushop.com. Uh, yep, yeah, I'll just go to museforyoushop.com and then go to shop. And then here it is, click on preview and you have access to it um, there and just click buy for $5 and you can download it. You'll get it as a zip file to your download, um, to your email, and then you can download the file. All right, so that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, thanks for watching. And if you like this video tutorial, you can subscribe below. Uh, you'll get access to the muse for You private community, the Google Plus private community. You'll get news and updates on new video tutorials that come out from the muse for You YouTube channel. And you'll get news and updates on new uh, icon sets and animations from the muse for You shop. Uh, yeah, from muse for You shop .com. Also in the description area will be links to all these resources that I mentioned in this video. And yeah, you can just click show more below. And there's a few other links that I have there. I have free resources and things like that. Yeah, and also check out museforyoushop.com. And yeah, there's videos, free resources, and just a lot of interesting things to, uh, yeah, a lot of resources to help you get started with your web, web design and development. All right, very good. So thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next video tutorial.